Hello everyone, I'm Sanok, and welcome back to some more Hollow Knight. It's been quite a bit since I got around to doing this again. Part of that is because I was working on building a new PC, and I only recently was able to get all the stuff set up again. So it's been a bit, so I'm not entirely sure where I was at when I left off. If I remember correctly, I was kind of at a bit of a standstill on what to do. So for now, I'm just gonna gonna head down more to the right, check around and see if I can find anything useful. I remember you. You have more of a versatile move set than you have more of a versatile move set than some other people. If I remember correctly, this was a... Yep, that's definitely a boss fight. So, you know what? I couldn't do it last time, but this time... Let's make that our goal for now. That was useless. So let's max out our soul meter. And then let's head up there and take a... Take a try at that boss. Or mini boss. Now, before I do this, let me check and see if I've got anything new, any kind of new abilities. Last time, I forgot about wall jump, and that was kind of embarrassing. Hmm. Hmm, guess I'm getting new abilities that kind of revolve around soul. Mothman cloak, wall jump, dashing, map, a note item, uh, lore. Oh yeah, I got these. Let's see what I can do. Soul catcher. Yeah, this is useful, and this one's less useful for. Hmm. And I'll swap it out for the extra invulnerability. I always get those two buds mixed up. This will be useful. Yeah, you're kind of easier when I know what moves you can do. Now, let's fight this guy again. Ah, there you are. What? What hit me? Oh, you have a rather fast projectile. This is a. This is not gonna be easy, is it? So I can use a terrain to my advantage. You don't like a. Uh, but you can shoot really quickly. That's it. I thought you were a boss. Well, that is a. Uh, it's actually a little disappointing. I was expecting a harder fight. Well, I almost did die there, but that was my first try, really, so... I appear to have made it to a cutscene. Or did my controller just break? Anyways, this place seems rather, uh... Significant. Soul Sanctum. And the music. Oh, you're you're new. You are also weak. Hmm. Oh, you're a common enemy, aren't you? Oh, that's this is not.
Okay, this is... Okay. It is... Okay. So I said I was a little disappointed earlier that they were uh, really easy to kill, but... Honestly, they're really hard to fight once they're, uh... They're almost... Yeah. Take it back. As a normal enemy, they are definitely a very big challenge to beat. You know, let's try this way this time. Might find something helpful this way. An alright door made from glistening metal. There's a slot for some kind of key. I'm guessing that might be more than just a simple key. So I might be finding it this way over here. I know that sound. Okay, this is a bit of a sticky spot. I appear to not be able to open that door from here, so... Mm -hmm. So they don't follow me down here. Good to know. Okay, so blitzing them works. Especially with that extra invincibility after a hit. That makes things, uh... Come on, do it. That was unfair. Okay. So those things are a little hard for me in particular to fight because I like taking things kind of slow and stuff, but it seems like the optimal strategy might not be taking it slow. Record ABBA, the mind limit is so to break past its constraints to attain a pure focus. Is it even possible? Hmm. Okay, got a door open. So is a key going to be up here? Is it going to be something different? Are you dead or are you like a statue? Okay. That's one way to make an entrance. You are interesting. Can't heal, I might as well attack. Huh. So is that a mini-boss, or are you going to be more common later on? Because if there's two of you, you're going to be covering each other's blind spots, and that's going to be kind of tough. Not you again. These things are kind of tough. Not durable, but kind of hard to take, avoid taking damage against these things. This is not an ideal place to fight.
fight these things in close quarters where their projectiles are easy to get blocked. That's not fair. Are you getting more durable? Let's try this way. Seems I'm off the map. Possibly. Okay, so we're back. We're back here. We just looped around. So we've got a shortcut now. Are you just gonna stand there? You will. Yeah, why did you take three hits earlier? So we seem to be unlocking more easier paths forward as we go. I wonder what these things are actually. Oh wait, I can check. Miss... Well that's rather rude of a name. Once a highly intelligent bug deformed by mis the misuse of soul. Okay, so I better not go too deep into any kind of dark magic type things. Soul Twister. Hmm. Interesting. I learned about Pin Blade. So kind of like a rapier. Hmm. Hmm. So these are people that are using the same kind of power as I am. I think I'm kind of grasping. It seems more like we're actually fighting intelligent beings of some kind, rather than just like zombies or something. Though why they're explicitly an enemy is still beyond me. That was a waste. You know, sometimes just brain dead. Bunga Bunga is actually the optimal strategy. Well, I say optimal, but we're still ending up with less soul than we began. I just noticed the sound of your projectile is the same as mine. And that's what the... Okay, that one was better done. What is this? This seems interesting. That is significant, but I don't know how yet. What happened? I don't know what I can do with that yet. Maybe there's some kind of ground pound ability. This is not good. Okay, clap me over here, yeah. I'm figuring out how you guys work. I've been here, haven't I? This seems kind of like a spot I could have been before. No, I haven't. I've never been here. There is a boss fight coming. There's no doubt there's a boss fight coming. Why else would these things be here? Yeah, it's a boss fight. What have we got? Oh! Hi there. You're not very happy, are you? The Soul Master. What have you got? Okay, where's... The gonna be a rather troublesome fight, I see. Okay, I can't hit that back.
Okay, there's my opening to attack. Okay, no opening there. No opening there either. What is that attack supposed to be anyways? Okay. Got it. What is that attack there? Like it's it's by far as weak as attack. It's honestly pathetic. Okay, you're gonna come. Okay. Okay. If I could get more than one attack in there, that'd be nice. You faked me out. I'm making progress then, if you're starting to do more strategies. That was unreasonably close. I should not have gotten. Did I get you? No, I haven't. Okay, so it's gonna be kind of like that first boss we faced where we have to weaken him down before we can actually deal damage, I think. That was a mistake. Gotcha this time. Okay, no fake out this time. Messed up. Thought I got healed, so... Only he was stunned after that attack, I might have to get some damage in. This one is kind of annoying, but it's predictable. Don't want to dash in for an attack because I don't want to over commit to anything, but I could get some more damage off if I did. This is a mistake. No, it's not. Got it. Wish you could duck. Okay. Nope. This is bad. I need just enough to heal once, please. No! I saw it coming, but still. And... I'm all the way back here. That was an interesting fight, though. I'm gonna try that again, because that was a very entertaining fight. I don't really think I can do that fight though, it's not... It's not gonna be easy, but I don't think it's impossible. Not you again. Can you just, you know, not... Go away. getting easier as I learn how to fight you. And here we are again. Yeah, 
There's my money back. Okay. Round two. I could get an attack off during that attack. My controller messed up there. I can't move. I could not. Yeah, there's something. Yeah, I need to charge my controller after this. I did not know I could take damage there. This is not off to a good start. I can get an attack off during that. to manage those uh, fireballs better so I don't have to worry about them working together. Okay. I can only get one attack off when he's in that kind of deflated state. Which means that it doesn't matter how many times I hit him, I guess. There we go. Okay, so as long as I dodge to the side, I'll be able to deal with it even if it is a fake out, I think. This attack is just weird. Yep. Yeah, I should. If he had faked out right there, I would have uh, taken the damage. Yeah, I need to dash instead of jumping first. Another pack off their map would be kind of risky. I could get another pack off there too. Everything else to show at me. Other than me being an idiot. funny. That was a fun boss fight. What have I got? What? Oh, oh no. Oh, it's a, that's a fake. This is new. This is... okay. 
I actually thought it was over. Okay, I see you got new openings. This is the stack attack is still not particularly dangerous. I can get off a lot of damage. So this time you're down for good. <laughs> that was that was generally actually surprising there. That was a that was a really good boss fight. Really enjoyed that. Is this one gonna be a fake out too? <laughs> I guess not. Desolate dive. Huh. I have a couple ideas of where this could be used. Such as a place like this. I see. I know another place this can be used back at the beginning of the game. Die. I cannot go through here. What do we have here? Hallow Nest Seal. What does this do? Soul Master. Head of the Soul Sanctum. Hoarded soul hoping to stave off Hallow Nest Affliction but eventually became intoxicated by its power. The bugs of Hellenus tried all kinds of tricks and rituals and prayers to rid themselves of the infection with no avail. Perhaps the infection came from somewhere deep inside of them that it could not escape. Hmm. So it seems like they are kind of out of their own control and stuff. They're not really in control of themselves in a way. Which is what separates them from the friendly ones upstairs. I see. These things are kind of annoying in how persistent you are. There are a lot of bodies here. Hmm. Interesting. That body moved. I think it's just a game mechanic, but I wonder what are the chances of that body having moved being a sign of a, another uh, boss fight phase with that guy. You know what, I'm just gonna go, cause, you know. Oh, neat. At this point, I'm not entirely sure what to do, but I think I don't have as much time for this one. So I'm just going to do a little, uh... There's something at the beginning of the game that I knew about from quite a long time, but I couldn't uh, figure out what to do with it. But now I think I know what I can do. So i got to head back up there, try that out, and see what happens. Here we are. entirely new area. I cannot get back up. What are you? Interesting. Are you just a regular enemy or are you gonna be... Nope.
I can only be destroyed from my, my head. Oh, another miner. You are not friendly. I thought you were going to be friendly. Are you from Mario? Hmm. Yeah, I can only attack it from our head. Hmm. I get the feeling that falling down might be fatal. I my feeling was correct. I didn't deal damage because I felt like I got pretty close to take damage, but I guess not. interesting. They're gonna be annoying in numbers, I think. I should be more careful around you. They've got a melee attack too. That's decent range for an enemy of your caliber. I'll do that later. I'm not sure it's kind of a Donkey Kong type level. I keep on comparing this to Donkey Kong. Ah. I can definitely see kind of inspiration in different enemies and stuff from other games. What do you do? Ah. Oh. That is... Yeah, that deals damage. I was not expecting an enemy that tough. Quest the hunter. Yeah, and it turns to the landmines. Fortunately, there's a gate between us. Okay, so though, don't move along the things so that. can get out of hand really quickly if I'm not careful. I I'm fighting four or five of those. They cover the ground and no time flat. Well, I think that's all the time I have for this episode. Got to see a very fun boss fight and discovered a new area that was nearby all along. So... I hope you enjoyed this episode, I really did, and make sure to check back later if you want to see some more, and make sure to have a good day.